This video will be on handles. Handles are the eight squares that surround an object when it is selected. So we're going to start out by clicking the text tool and go over here and clicking on our page and typing the word text. When I go back up here and click the pick tool, you can see we have eight squares that surround our text and uh, that way we know it's selected. Now these squares are actually what we're calling the handles. The handles on this object can be used to size it either larger or smaller and in this case we want to make it a little larger so I'm going to click on the bottom right handle here and pull down and as you can see our object in this case text gets larger. Now as long as this is, is selected um, we'll have all eight of these handles showing and each one of the corner handles will always enlarge or reduce the size of our object in proportion to the original uh, size that we started with. So you can use any four of those corner handles and know that you've kept it symmetrical. Now our four side handles um, at the top and bottom, left and right, are used to adjust the size of our object uh, disproportional to what we've started with. In other words, here I have changed the left and right dimensions of our text but I have not changed the height at all and I'm going to hit control Z and undo that and that's the same for the top bottom left and right all of those um, make uh, disproportional adjustments to the size of the object so that's pretty straightforward how that works um, the corners keep everything proportional and I'm going to show you that by putting a circle on the screen and this is a perfect circle and I'm drawing that by holding down the control key as I drag the, my object onto the screen. When I let up it will show as a perfect circle. Now as long as um, I use these corners this will remain a perfect circle. No matter which corner I use it, it still remains as you can see up here um, it, it is still the same height and width. If I was to use one of these it quickly becomes um, an oval or an ellipse because the adjustments have been made disproportionate to its original size. So that's the basics of our eight control handles that you'll see um, when an object is selected and it's easy to get those control handles up. You just click on the object itself, those eight handles come up and you can use those to um, size your object um, as you need to.